May <laughs> in a couple of days here, buddy. I know. We were spoiled over the weekend, weren't we? Uh, gust of 40 on Saturday, 82 degrees. Gust near 50 on Sunday, even a few midday showers, and we still got to 74. What a great weekend. And then today, back into the 50s. Normal highs about 58 to 60 degrees across the area. A little bit warmer, obviously, inland. Uh, your highs today were in the 40s in the inland areas. 49 in Burlington, 46 Waukesha, 45 in Beaver Dam. And then we had the wind anywhere from 15 to 30 miles per hour, keeping wind chills in the 30s all day. The wind is starting to calm down a little bit. It's westerly at around 15 miles per hour. The temperature already 37 at this hour in Waukesha. That's putting wind chills into the upper 20s. So the chill is back and might be with us for a little while dry for most of the week, but there is one day where there's a slight chance and then unfortunately weekend rain showers. We're not going to get a repeat of last weekend. It's going to be in the 50s with some rain. Here are your current wind chills 29 in West Bend as well as Waukesha 32 Whitewater and Watertown 33 in Fond du Lac and with the temperatures continuing to drop and the winds around 10 to 15, you will see some wind chills near 20 degrees by morning. Yes, we cool down almost 25 degrees today. Cold front coming through as we speak. It's a weak front, but it's just kind of reinforcing the chill for the next couple of days. And yes, those are snow showers around Duluth Superior and International Falls behind that front today. It was only in the 20s and 30s, 29 in Fargo for a high 39 in Minneapolis. And these are areas that we're seeing the 70s and the 80s over the weekend. Tonight we drop into the upper 20s in Watertown, 34 in Sheboygan and 36 in Racine. The clouds are gradually clearing out, so you will have some sunshine tomorrow in the morning and early afternoon before some clouds develop in the late afternoon. Winds pick up as well. We'll be about 10 degrees below normal as we stay in the upper 40s, and that is even warmer than what it will be on Wednesday. So tomorrow enjoy the sunshine. Just a few late afternoon clouds along the lakefront. Clouds increase on Wednesday, some sprinkles in the afternoon and could see a few scattered rain showers, especially south and west of Milwaukee in the evening hours of Wednesday. And then Thursday could see just a little bit of light rain during the day, not a washout, but just some spotty showers here and there. Otherwise, if your grass is growing like mine is, you need to get that first cut or put the fertilizer down. Looks good tomorrow and Wednesday, even though it's chilly. Thursday, that slight chance of rain and Friday looks dry as well. Tonight, dropping down close to freezing inland to 35 at the lakefront. Northwest winds at 10 to 15. And then for a Tuesday, 48 Milwaukee, lower 40s inland. And that wind will keep the wind chills in the 30s. I have only 40 on Wednesday, 44 with those few raindrops on Thursday and back into the 50s for the weekend. But rain likely Saturday and into early Sunday. Here's Amir, eight years old. I'm sorry, Amir, he had to get the sweatshirt back on, the hat and the gloves, but hopefully soon. We'll be back to the shorts and t-shirts. I'm not touching my lawn until next week. It's just too iffy. It's too wet. It's it is spongy. <laughs> it's spongy. <laughs> Ryan, thank you. <laughs>